What's good? What's good, Cancer? So we are doing your reading for you and your person. My readings are for Sun, Moon, and Rising. They are general, so if it doesn't resonate with you, check out your Moon and your Rising video. Any extra information you would like to know is in the description box, okay? What do we have for Cancer and their person? Universe, Spirit, and Guides. What do we have for Cancer and their person? Three shuffles. Page of Swords wanted to come out Cancer, so there could be a lot of spying, observing, um, curiosity here between the two of you. Let's see. All right, so Cancer, in your feelings when it comes to this person, we have the Nine of Pentacles. Tell me about the Nine of Pentacles and Cancer's feelings. With the Two of Wands in reverse. And the Three of Cups in reverse. So Cancer, you are not feeling very optimistic here about a, a, a union between the two of you, okay? A lot of you guys don't even feel like this person's an option, if I'm gonna be honest with you, or you're in this energy of, is this person an option? Okay, you may feel with the Nine of Pentacles, this person rather be single, or they're, they're projecting this energy where you feel like they're not interested in a relationship or they're not interested in some form of union. Um, you may feel like this person is just very focused on themselves right now. I feel like you guys are waiting for more understanding or more clarity. It's almost like you're looking at this person like, like you're intrigued by this bird, but you're not sure if this bird is, is here to stay or you're not sure if you should hold on to it. You know, it's almost this energy of like, I don't know if this is possible. Is this possible? You don't know. Okay. How you're viewing this person, Cancer, is the Three of Wands. Tell me about the Three of Wands with how Cancer is viewing this person. With the Chariot in reverse, one more. And the Ace of Cups. Cancer, I feel like you like this person, okay? Because of the way they're, because of the way they are. With the Three of Wands to the Ace of Cups, you may see this as someone that, you know, is very loving. It's like they know their worth. Um, with the Three of Wands, you may feel like this person is manifesting, you know, um, other things in their life right now. It's almost like you feel like this person has their back turned to the situation. It's, it's like you feel like this person is, you know, focusing on everything else but you, okay? Because you are viewing them as a chariot in reverse. It's like, for whatever reason, you feel like they're not motivated to invest in you. It's like you're, you're looking at them like they're not interested in me. They wouldn't want me or um, they're not coming back if it's a past person, right? You're definitely having a hard time lacking faith, but that lack of faith is coming from a place of insecurity. So just pay pay attention to that, okay? Don't undermine your your own potential as a spirit. But you yeah, you feel like this person is you're viewing them as someone that is focusing on, you know, their personal goals and manifesting other things, and you feel like they're not motivated at all at all to hold on to you or to invest into you, okay? In your person's feelings, we have the Empress in reverse. Tell me about the Empress in reverse. With the Hangman in reverse. One more.
pair font in reverse. Seven of Pentacles at the bottom, I knew it. This is someone that is in an energy cancer for whatever reason where they really are overthinking if they invest, invest their energy into situations, okay? This is someone that is being very careful with how they invest their energy if they invest into love. Um, it's like this is someone that is trying very hard to not let anything hold them down right now. Okay, it could be because of a lack of faith. Um, this is someone not nurturing this because they're scared it's going to hold them down or they're scared um, it's going to keep them stuck in some way, shape, or form. It's like, again, someone that is almost repressing their intuition. If you already know this person or been communicating with them, this is someone repressing their intuition on the situation because they're... It's like they're, I feel like it's a commitment issue if I'm going to be honest with you. It's a commitment issue. Okay, it's like, it's almost like someone that's trying to not be involved in too much right now. <clears throat> okay, how they're viewing you is the Ten of Wands in reverse. Tell me about the Ten of Wands in reverse with how they're viewing Cancer. with the two of pentacles in reverse, one more. <clears throat> and the ace of pentacles. So Cancer, this is someone that feels like you may be offering them something or you're trying to bring some level of stability into their life without actually putting in the work, okay? I do feel like your person is looking at you as someone very abundant or someone that's almost like a blessing, but at the same time, they feel like you're not really catering to them or they feel like you're not really putting in the work to make this happen. It's like they're off, they're looking at you like someone that is a blessing, but yet you're not putting in the work. So it's almost like they're having a hard time trusting this, okay? For some of you, they may feel like you drop this to invest into, into something else or they may feel like you're very focused on your work. Um, it's almost like they see this as like, uh, risky investing into you because they feel like you're not really giving them too much to work with either okay what you're not expressing to this person cancer is the four of swords tell me about the four of swords with what cancer isn't expressing to this person with the nine of swords in reversed and the knight of cups strength in reverse Cancer, you guys are pulling away from a situation. What you're not expressing to them is this person is on your mind a lot. You think about this person a lot. But at the same time with the Nine of Swords in reverse, you're it's almost like you're not taking your own thoughts seriously because you're avoiding some form of ascension or you're avoiding letting go of something else, right? When we're in the Nine of Swords in reverse, it's like we're trying to make do with what we have. We're trying to not get to the Ten of Swords where we actually have to release something that's not good for us. It's almost like you think about this person a lot, Cancer, but you're not taking it seriously because you're avoiding some form of ascension or you're avoiding addressing bigger issues here, um, however that resonates for you. You're not, take, you're not taking yourself seriously, okay? What your person isn't expressing to you is the star card in reversed. Tell me about the star in reversed. With the emperor in reversed. I need one more. One more. And the Five of Cups. This is someone that's holding on to some form of past trauma, Cancer. Um, they definitely have control issues. This is someone that is not taking control in the situation with you because, again, they're something in the past disappointed this person, whether it was with you or someone else, and they're, they're scared, okay? Something is going to repeat itself. Okay, five of pentacles in reverse at the bottom. You're dealing with someone that has commitment issues or they're scared that you're gonna hurt them or if this is a past person, it's like they feel like something's gonna repeat itself or they just straight up have commitment issues or they're holding on to something, someone else. 
there's a past energy here that may have created created a lot of emotional damage and it's like they're not re ready to address that that healing yet which is why they're avoiding taking control with you this could be someone involved in another connection as well, if I'm going to be honest with you, and they're still mourning that, okay? This person may be still mourning the disappointment of, of something else, okay? Action you plan on taking, Cancer, is the eight of, eight of Wands. Tell me about the Eight of Wands with action Cancer plans on taking. Ooh! Fast action towards something stable with the Ten of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles. So Cancer, I feel like you are wanting to get on the same page with this person. You could work with this person as well. Um, what causes this Eight of Wands? What causes this? What triggers it? Because an ending happened. There's some form of ending that happens, whether it's with you, Cancer, or with this person that allows the potential of the two of you coming together. Okay, so I do feel like you are going to communicate with this person, okay, as soon as something comes to an end or you find out something comes to an end or whatever it may be, that you want to build up with this person. The Eight of Wands can be like the receiver of communication. It just comes out of nowhere. You may find out for a lot of you that this person has ended something else, which opens a door for you to be more vulnerable. Okay, action your person plans on taking is the Knight of Swords in reversed. Tell me about the Knight of Swords in reversed. With action, Cancer's person plans on taking. Ooh, with the King of Wands in reverse and the Five of Wands. Seven of Pentacles, you're dealing with someone that over, is overthinking love right now. Um, this is someone that is very careful with what they get wrapped up into. Um, oh, maybe that's why. For some of you, Cancer, this person has a fire sign possibly, or this could be you, okay? There, there could be a fire sign on your side that's getting involved with this, but there's someone here that is very jealous, very jealous. Because it's almost like your person feels like they can't be honest or they can't open up because of this fire sign or someone that keeps getting involved here. Give me more in the Knight of Swords in reverse with the Fool in reverse. Someone feels stuck. Okay, someone's being very careful, Cancer, and I feel like it has nothing to do with you. Someone's trying to get around a very jealous energy whether that's an ex on your side or this person's side, there's this fire sign, the king of wands in reverse is someone that's someone that's very abusive mentally or, you know, God forbid, physically. This is someone that doesn't like when things don't go their way. And based on the rest of the energy, I don't feel like it's your person. I feel like this is someone else. Someone keeps getting in the way of the two of you coming together. And it's almost like this person feels silenced. Someone's silencing them. And I know that's really dramatic, okay? Um, now, there's all ends of the spectrum there, but this is someone that... <sighs> Something causes a lot of drama or conflict with this King of Wands. Now, it could be a woman too, right? It's just the energy. Someone that feels entitled. They feel... You know, and just based on the, your person's energy, this is someone that fears this. Maybe that's why they fear a relationship or a connection with you because they're dealing with this king of wands or they're used to an energy that was very jealous, very abusive mentally or whatever it may be. Let's just see. What will be the most likely outcome? The Wheel of Fortune and the Seven of Cups in reverse, Ace of Wands. I do see a new beginning, okay? You may doubt it because it may take longer than you'd hoped or um, I kind of get this energy cancer that if you open up or if you're honest you're gonna almost be not scared off but confused by the reaction because the six of wands in reverse it's like there's a lot of confusion you may not feel like it's being reciprocated the way you want it to be reciprocated but I feel like it has nothing to do with you I feel like it has to do with something else whether it's family an ex there's someone here that keeps getting in the way of the two of you 
but I do see a decision is going to be made here to have some form of change and have a new beginning. Okay. Ooh, okay. Cancer. Give me a love card for cancer, please. Oh, there is a codependent situation here or obsession, possession, controlling. Someone has a block or restraint. There's some form of obsessive energy here that keeps getting in the way of the two of you. Um, so time with friends, being happily si single, um, live in the moment, have fun. Okay, so again, just have fun. Don't take things too seriously and don't take things personally as well, especially if there's other people in the mix. Use your intuition wisely, right? Um, the relationship is evol evolving to the next phase. Someone is healing their inner child or past childhood trauma. Okay, so I hope this helped you. Cancer for signs, guys. We have Taurus, Pisces, Virgo, Aquarius, Aries, Cancer. Could be any sign as far as elements go, okay? I love you. Yes.